Alright, well, it is day three of our Fragapalooza shenanigans. Which, I don't even know how to give freaking intros anymore. I've done so many streams during this event of all kinds of games. I was looking through my game library, like, what would be another cool thing to stream during this, uh, during this event? Also, I need to pull up my chat, uh, properly, because my layout's all, like, weird and stuff, because I'm not at home, evidently. Uh, oh, now we have the inferior theme. I gotta reload it again. Boobity bop, yeah. There we go. How are you doing today, Crystal? Oh, I forgot. I think I also forgot to set the, uh, game capture to the thing where Bob... Well, um... Oh. Oh. Specific window. There we go. Roller Coaster Tycoon Classic. Now we should be good. Now we should be A-OK, -okay, I think, probably, to start things. So, will it show up on... Yes, it will. I gotta click off and... So that I don't have, like, a red bar across OBS there. There. Now we're good to go. But yeah, um, pretty good. But can't believe you missed a new stream. Yeah, I just wanted to do, like, a short one earlier. Because I wanted to do, like, at least one stream of, like, all my currently ongoing playthrough stuff while here. Just because, you know, it's something so different. It's something very different. So for anyone who's not familiar, Fragapalooza is a four-day annual land gaming event that usually goes on in this uh, big rec center that usually has like hundreds upon hundreds of people like lined up all with their uh, gaming setups and such, all just playing games and having fun together and whatnot. But then COVID happened. So for the past couple of years, it's had to go online. I've been the one hosting and commentating the Smash tournaments for the past couple of years. And this year, we're not back to like full in person of like hundreds of people. We're doing what's called a hybrid event this year, which is like, you know, the events and stuff are still being hosted online, but yeah, there will be like an in-person venue that it's based out of, which is, you know, a smaller thing for Bob here, which I believe there's like a maximum capacity of like 60, and I think we had like 56 people that have like a dedicated seat, I believe. I don't think all 56 people are here right now, as you can see on the venue cam, like a lot of the monitors are off and whatnot. But yeah, so we've been doing a whole bunch of gaming for the past couple of days. We did, a, I hosted and commentated a Smash tournament yesterday. We did a short thing with freaking the RC car Mario Kart earlier today, so I still have like the little Luigi car here. Because still see back there the freaking pizza box <laughs> contraption that I made for like a ramp to go up the stage and stuff. Still haven't taken it down yet. Because I figured like, oh, what if we want to do it like late at night randomly? I don't know. I don't know. What time is it even? It's freaking 6.14, but it feels like it's late at night because all the lights are off already. So... You know, there's that. And hello as well, Mythic. How are you doing? This is a pod game. It is. I was literally looking through my library being like, okay, I've now done at least a stream of all my currently ongoing playthrough stuff and more on this channel. So, what else is there? What else might I actually want to play that's like non-playthrough wise? Because I don't want to commit to like too much story stuff for my playthroughs. Like, that's why the near stream was short. That's why I don't want to like do too much in Xenoblade Chronicles 3, for example. Because like big story heavy games, I want to do those most, like, mostly at home and not you know, in a big venue like this. So I was like, what's something chill that, like, it really doesn't matter, like, where it's done and there's not really much story and stuff. And I saw Roller Coaster Tycoon and I was like, oh my goodness, there's my answer. But yeah, I never played Classic, usually play Open RCT2. Yeah, I've heard good things about it, but you know, I've gotten so used to playing Classic at that point and whatnot. But yeah, Roller Coaster Tycoon is the most you game you just can't get into, you can't? <laughs> Well, let's see here. I'm not sure what park we're gonna do today. This is one of those playthroughs where, you know, we just do a park from time to time when I feel like chilling. And I felt like chilling tonight and just taking it easy and stuff. So that's what we're doing. So that's what we're doing. We've done Force Frontiers, Dynamite Dunes, and Fun Fortress. We skipped there. All these have been done, like, in the past. I used to play Classic on my phone, and I transferred my save data to my computer, and then, like, you know, I guess early 2020 i freaking transferred over that save data and like you know got all these parks done but for the sake of doing them on the channel you know i like redo them here and whatnot but you know i might be i might be tempted to do one of these ones yeah open rc2 2 as a multiplayer feature i have heard about that i have heard it yeah like with the base game it has a ride cap of 255 and open rc2 to raise that to a number high enough so it's pretty much unlimited now i never even realized there was a ride cap i don't know if there's a ride cap in classic or not Worst case scenario, I can always, like, transfer save data and stuff like that, probably. I always save, like, right before an objective is complete, so, like, you know, I have save data for, like, all these finger bobs. I was thinking about doing something weird, like, you know, throw a wrench into the works. Because, you know, I've done, like, all these so many times. I've named freaking episode four of my Minecraft series after this right here, Leafy Lake. But, yeah, I have not finished Xenoblade Chronicles 3 episode. I'm not even close. And I have, like, 35 hours in the game, and it feels like everybody else I know is, like, super ahead of me <laughs> in that respect. But, yeah, Rodcap is mostly noticeable on multiplayer with unlimited money on a mass plot. Ah, that would make sense there. How about we do a weird one? How about we do Iceberg Islands? I think I started playing this one, like, on mobile. 
like, you know, before I was even, or was it while I was a content creator? I don't remember. I don't even remember there. Um, but I never finished it, so, like, let's do a weird one. Let's do a freaking weird one with, like, all kinds of, like, weird terrain and stuff. Um, cool. Alright, let's see here. So, collection of icebergs make a cold setting for this ambitious theme park. I'm gonna move my microphone a little bit closer. Yeah, let's do a weird one like this for funsies and see what happens. And let's do something fitting for the land of Canada here. Good old Canada. Also, the thing going on back there, the main Fragapalooza stream, will have like one main thing being showcased from one of their content creators at one point, And like the other ones will be like showcased on the side and whatnot. I only just started the stream stream, but after a little bit, we're very likely going to be like one of the side ones over there. Most likely and such. But yeah, like building some games can handle not non-grid based ones. So the older RZC is really appealing, but don't really understand the game very much. I mean, they are also designed so that you can beat it without needing to, like, really understand the game inside and out. Like, I got the first game from a cereal box, and I just started, you know, messing around with things. And it took me, you know, a great many months before I fully understood, like, all the buttons and, like, things that you could do. But, you know, the parks are never designed to be, like, super duper challenging because the creator, Chris Sawyer, wanted to focus on it being, like, fun before it being a challenge. So, let's see what we are working with here, first and foremost. So, let's go ahead and go to research. So... Uh, probably maximum funding here is what I like to start with and then I always just do wait Do we need shops and stalls? I guess that's something that we're gonna have to check really quickly You always want to check that at the beginning of a park uh, Now we have the things that we need we have all the things that we need Yeah, so we don't need to be researching shops and stalls. So what all are we working with here? Oh, I gotta use the arrow keys to Look around and stuff here. So how do you rotate again? It's been oh like that there. So is this the uh, entrance here? Is this the uh, park entrance? Yeah, it is okay, and it's a free Entry there. Yeah, so this is where we get in there. If you want to understand the classic RCC games inside and out, so just I've heard of that channel myself, but yeah. Or you could just have played like as a kiddo and grown up with it and stuff. So it looks like there's like a bobsled kind of coaster thing where Bob and a chairlift across to here. And then we have like other iceberg islands out here where we can start making things. So this begs the question do I want to start building like onto here? Or do I want to start making a path where I can just start, like, establishing stuff, like, over here and leave this area, like, kind of semi-pristine, is what I wonder. I'm kind of leaning towards starting with, like, something fresh, but at the same time, like, I could build- Oh, and there's mini golf! Look at that, that's cool! You know? No, yeah, it's, don't, don't worry about that there, Mythic, yeah. No problemo there. Wait, Iceberg Golf is free? But the park entry fee is free. Hold on, what the heck? This needs to uh, make something at least How about this. Why are they all starting at free? It's not one of those parks that. Nope. I don't know if I did this back when, uh, you know, I was doing this on mobile forever ago. Maybe that's why I was struggling in this park like forever ago. Because not one of those ones where you set an entry free, an entry free, an entry fee. Like it's a chairlift. Like I'll say one dolan something like that like can't charge too much for that if it's the only way to go over to here like i might make a different path over there later so what rides are we working with initially let's see here so we start with a few good ones there oh we have a decent selection i mean most of these are like you know these kinds of things that are going to be a little bit sketchy you know but you know we can fit some things in there but like i might actually have to adjust things here like oh yeah, I would need to adjust it a little bit more, I guess. So let's do this. Like that. And we can have, like, a path kind of going up this way. And then... Like, how am I best going to expand up here? Uh, how am I going to make, like, good use of this space? Is the, uh, is the first question here. So, I mean... Let's see here. Oh, yeah, that's kind of weird like that, huh? Oh, okay. Sometimes it's kind of hard to tell in these, like, older 2D games, like, what's what going on and whatnot. I'm tired of running out of center of the Minecraft server, so you're currently at a desert 11,000 plus blocks away from your base playing for shulker bogs in the sand. Wow. Well, it sounds like you're getting, like, things figured out there, at least. Wait, can I, like... I could then make, like, the entrance there, and then have, like... Or the exit, like, right there, and then have, like, the entrance go around. Or... Yeah, because that just, like, tunnels through there. Oh, so I can't do that over there. Yeah, too high for supports. But I can just have this, like, flat here. That actually sounds pretty cool, you know. That sounds pretty cool and stuff. So we can do something like that. Did it automatically get rid of the, uh... No, it did not. 
That did not. So if I go ahead and say, how do I? There we go. There we go. Jeez. Also, there's a uh, potluck that they're like getting ready for over there. I brought some. Uh, I brought some thingamabobs for the potluck as well. So like during this, there's a chance that I might be like going and grabbing some foods from over there. I think there's just like preparation stuff going on. I don't think anyone's grabbing foods yet. But yeah, look at that the big fragapalooza thingamabob there. Got sand. I don't have sand. I don't have it. I'm out of sand in my base right now as well. So I'm gonna have to get some of that at some point as well. I'm gonna have to do higher. Hello. This is uh this is the kind of video game that I was playing when I was really young, right here. Is is that roller coaster so cool? Oh heck yeah, heck yeah it is. <laughs> but we bop this away, and then I can just like. No, oh, I'm gonna have to like delete this then. Yeah. Whoops. Dang it. I've got more super juice. <laughs> got more of that Gatorade there. No. Yeah. This is this is old school stuff. I don't know what kind <laughs> of game is. Gatorade. <laughs> Oh, you're drinking Red Bull. <laughs> my, oh my. I yeah, will go ahead and open that up. Yeah, when I was first getting into video games, it, uh, this is what I was playing when I got it from a cereal box. Yeah, it is a simpler version of the UI without, like, the bazillion buttons at the top. But, you know, you still have everything you need. It's just, like, you know, a bunch down here, wait, you know, wait, different places and whatnot. I'm gonna have no, to recolor um, this here. No, this was one of the first games that I did play. Oh, you did? <laughs> yeah, so, um, it was number two, though. Mm. I mean, this. Is, I mean, like, this is basically like RCT one and two together. Yeah, my uncle said he would like this game. Like he. Do, do I know him or is it on the other side of the family? Joe. Oh, okay, yeah. He got me roller coaster. Oh yeah, I guess uncles would just be you know my cousins essentially. I don't know why I'm losing my mind here. Yeah, that's just yeah. Well, good man then. Good man there then. <laughs> Something like that. That's a nice little color there. Me, uh, roller coaster tycoon and Overwatch at the same time. <laughs> Two very different games right there. One peaceful where you build roller coasters, or you can make people fall to their deaths. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it can be a pretty violent game if you handle it or like Overwatch, that. Watch where you literally murder yourself. Yourself? What? <laughs> if somebody else is playing the same characters. <laughs> sure, let's go ahead and do this. But yeah, oh, Myth is asking you if you need any sand. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Need sand? Um, I mean... Sure? Can you get free TNT stuff? <laughs> Let's see here, I'll go ahead and do snow entrance there. Because, like, just in case we feel like randomly doing it late at night and whatnot, I don't know. Because, like, you know, my my doubles partner in Crash there, he, uh, he'll be getting here a little bit later tonight and whatnot. But yeah, if you have an exit building that enters the side of a cliff, the guests will leave, fall into the void, and vanish. It will not count. Really, it doesn't count as a death. Because there's only practical on paper entry park, but it's neat. I didn't know that, like, they wouldn't, uh, that they wouldn't bite the dust. Well, I need to do, uh, this version of the Q-Path. So I'm gonna have to do... There we go. And then I'll, um... So how am I gonna form this, like, down here, I wonder? Because, yeah, this is my plan here, is the case. Can I fit- I can just fit like a spiral slide there if I'm really gonna get creative with like, you know, my spacing here. Like, I technically could. Oh. But then the path would have to go around, but I can do that. And a spiral slide really doesn't need a long queue path anyway, is the thing. So... Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I can have the path like go around then in that case. So... Let's see here. Yeah, that's good. Always go into this and change the uh, maximum guess on route. I don't know why. That's two by default. So then if I figure out, like, how exactly this is going to uh, be going down and stuff. Let's see. Let's just see here. Whoop, not the queue line. Go ahead and do this there. Hey, I could try it. Just raise land in front of an exit building. Hide the terrain. Make patiently watch the gorgeous falling through the world. So penitently for doing it other than, I guess, leaving the park after the ride. I mean, maybe it's different in classic. Potentially. Oh, this is a this is a little bit weird here then. If only I could pull this back like one. You ready for some sweet meat taters? Yeah, I'm sure it'll be great. Yeah. I'm sure, it'll be pretty good. I mean, I could just have it come out like more, I guess. I'm gonna have to take out more loan then. So I'm gonna have to do. Yeah, I can do like a zigzaggy weird thing then. That's what I can technically do, like that. And I mean, I guess that works, you know, bam, 
Also, do we have food and drink things, and do we have staff right now? Or is that something that I'm gonna have to figure out here? Because now we have, like, a good handful of rides, at least, is the thing. That'll be making us a little bit. So let's see here. So we don't start out with... Okay, we start with, like, a mechanic. I should, uh... I'm gonna go ahead and hire a janitor as well. We just unlocked the haunted house. Neat. But yeah. Magician, what, mythic for those strats there? Or me, like, figuring out how to fit things into this space. And whatnot. <laughs> figuring out how to compact things just right. Alright, let's see here. I will also have to put down, you know, trash thingamabobs and, you know, benches and stuff. So, let's see here. Yeah, so I'll have some things. Also, wait, do we have a, um, any food thingamabobs? We do not. That's a concern. We're actually gonna have to put that down. Figure out how to compact things. Amazing. I have a lot, a lot of hours in Rollercoaster Tycoon. And I apply it to, I apply it to my freaking Minecraft series, interestingly enough. Like that whole peculiar potion series we're doing in the hideaway. I literally feel like I'm playing Rollercoaster Tycoon when I, uh, when I play that. <laughs> this is the thing. It's certainly something. I kind of like to alternate a lot of the time. Like, uh, between trash and benches and stuff. So I like to do. Where's the, uh, it's been a while since I played Classic. I'm always used to playing, like, the old school stuff. So, where do I change the view in this? Uh, not the map. Um, where do you, where do you change the view in this? I like to see, like, through the ground and stuff. I actually don't remember. I straight up do not. Like, um, options. Oh, underground view. Okay, yeah, I can do that there then. But yeah, best part about the tile-based RCT games that's lost on Planet Coast, you can actually make things, but yeah, you can really compact things then. Yeah, that I I do like Planet Coaster. I do like the uh, older uh, RCTs as well. I think that they both have their charms, you know. But yeah, also the fact that this game is literally 2D means that you know you only have like the four exact angles. So if there isn't a shot that gives you like the angle that you want, you're basically screwed. What can only be built across paths? Okay, it didn't. And like, it's, sometimes it can be a little bit tricky trying to click on what you actually want to click on. Sometimes it's a little bit tricky. Yeah, we'll just get this all, like, decked out and stuff. That's what we'll do. Sure. Doesn't need to be, like, exact. Usually I have, like, a tile gap and then, like, alternate them, but... Whoops. Fine. There's two there, I guess. I guess there's, there's two there in this case. We'll go back to, like, some alternating here. Boop a bop Not sure. Yeah, they don't need to be, like, super frequent. Just, like, here and there and then, uh... You know, just so that people aren't, you know, littering in my park a whole lot. And so they're not getting too tired with their legs and stuff. Whoops, I meant to alternate there, but whatever. Whatever, I guess. Boopity-bop. I'm trying to do it across pads. I'm trying my best here. Boop. Okay. So, how do they get up to there, anyway? It's gotta be, like, another path. But yeah, I love playing close, but my gosh, the pathing system is awful. I mean, it's good for what it is for, like, freeform kind of stuff, but it's, you know... Not good for, like, compaction and stuff. I might do the information kiosk strat that I sometimes do. Wait. Okay, so yeah, this goes... Wait. Whoa, 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 wait. Does that actually go under the thingamabob? That looks like it goes that way. It does. Wow. So it actually, um... But where does it go? Does it go to that other island? Because the light goes down to here. Can I hide water? I'd land surface, I'd vertical land. Ah, I'd scenery, I'd support, I'd people. Yeah, it does go. Wow. Okay. Yeah, so they can get to that island without me needing to make like a path across the top because there already is a way over there. Okay, that's interesting. But yeah, they need you to be able to switch from freeform to tile base for the paths. That way you can make them perfectly square. You can though. You can do that. In Planet Coaster. Touch a path to a building, you can do something similar, but it's so janky to do it that way. There is a grid option in Planet Coaster. Like, not for the rides, though. Like, you can't attach the rides to the same grid as, like, the paths. But when you, like, start a tile with a uh, path, you can do, like, the other tiles according to the grid. That's what you can do. Tis an option there. Yeah. So, let's make sure that this is all, you know, set up here. Just kind of, like, future-proof this and stuff is my plan. And I might see about putting an information kiosk there. Sure. And this goes underground there as well. Yeah, that's interesting. I am rather intrigued about this. Oh. Boopity bop. Yeah, shouldn't be as much a, 
and I skip that one, and then I do this. It's typically my kind of system that I do under normal circumstances. But yeah, what you're seeing you can only do this help house when attached to a building, so it builds based on that grid. No, you can put down like a path, and then like do the grid based on that initial tile that you put down, or like another tile path that's already down there. Is what you can do. It is a thing. I'm trying to place it on paths. I'm trying. Okay, it's weird. It's weird. Well, I guess there's just a three bunch there. Who only needs grids, IRL grid? I know, right? What's up with that? Okay, yeah, I, I kind of got to select, like, in front of it then. I guess is the case. I am glad that there is a way that isn't, you know, isn't making the chair lift mandatory. Right, I don't know if that's according to, like, the grid there, but whatever. Here, I'm just going to put some trash things along the side there, put like some benches and stuff. But yeah, now four choco box of sand and one choco box of sandstone. Sounds like you got pretty loaded there. Sounds like you got really loaded with that, in that a case. All right. Yeah. Just get this all set up, because if I don't do it right now, it's gonna screw me over later, you know? Is the case. What's going on here? It's another thing about it being a 2D game, sometimes it's hard to tell what's going on. So that'd be like bench. And trash. Something like this. So let's see here. What? I'm trying. I'm trying here, I swear. Then I'll just like put a thing there. But yeah, welcome back, Fire Eye. Back for the streams. It's you, the Burden Flame, aka Gino. Ah, welcome back to Gino, in case you forgot. You need to get back to the Platinum Grind for Blue's team. It's Fire Red, Leaf Green team, the starter and the split. Wait, yeah, what? I don't know what blues team there is exactly, but welcome on in, Fire Red. Welcome to Fragapalooza here. You know, so this is, you know, clearly not my home that I'm streaming from right now. But yeah, let's see here. The bins and benches are just decoration. Bin just, yeah, it's in the decoration tab, but they actually have a function. If people have litter and they don't have like a nearby trash can, then they'll just toss it on the ground. And if people are getting like high exhaustion and whatnot, they might want to sit down on a bench is a thing so there's an actual function i don't know why they're in the decoration i guess because they are sort of decorative but they also have a function but yeah it took me a very long time to figure that out as a kiddo that you know they have a function there and stuff okay i think all the paths are decked out i do want to set up my uh setup with the information kiosk at the uh at the entrance there oh well, moving the uh, table partially back so i wonder if i can like do something like this because I always like having, like, a thing around an information kiosk at, like, the entrance of my parks. Like, it has, makes a very good chance of people actually interacting with the information kiosk and getting, like, you know, map and stuff. We'll have this first set of umbrellas be, like, out of blue or something like that. There we go. Sure. There. That's, now we've got a very good information kiosk set up there. And I'll go ahead and just put some, uh, some thing where Bob's around there as well. Just to make sure that people aren't, uh... You know, doing things there. So what exactly is going on here? Yeah, so there are some paths around here. So if I go ahead and hide the, uh, if I do this. So that goes up to, that's the exit of the thing we're about. Okay. Yeah, interesting. So that goes out to there. So yeah, this is an option. So I probably don't need to, like, branch out to another one of these islands for, you know, a little while. I don't think. Because I have all this space here that's basically untapped. And I'm still working at, like, filling some things here. So, now that's established there, I might want to establish, like, a food court area. But yeah, benches will help with reducing nausea on guests. Ah! Shnice, nice then. His champion team, Titar, Heracross, who's a beast, Pidgeot, Kadabra, Exeggator, and Arcanine. Trade the Pokemon, all that from Pokemon Fire Red. Trade me transfer. It sounds like you're getting, like, all set up and stuff. Getting things all figured out there. But yeah, streams a learning experience for you. Gonna learn all about Rollercoaster Tycoon. I'm gonna make a path up this way. What if I turn, like, this into, like, a weird food court area? Or something. Like, I'll probably find a way to put down, like, some rides first. So that I can just, like, put food court stuff around it. You know? Do we have any other thrill rides right now? I mean, there's this. It's, like, the much, it's a really tame kind of thrill ride. And I can have it right next to this here. But then... Sure, I'll do it. I'm always having, like... You know, just as little loan as possible, so I'm paying, you know, as little on it as I can to, you know, save some cash in the long run. Oh, I want to change the uh, look of that as well. 
That's what I want to do. But yeah, if you're unaware, the guess I am, this game is really good at getting lost. If possible, have a few dead ends. Possible in your path, though. Yeah, that's something that I found out back in the day. This is the thing. But yeah, you know what? Because you can grind when you're playing Bloons TD6. No idea what that is, but... Sounds like a hell of fun time. What? Did I... Did I raise it and then... Did I lower it then raise it again? My goodness gracious. Maybe that's what I did. Alright, so that's a location for a thing. And then another potential thing we're about. I can have, like, some more chill rides up here. I don't know a I don't know Bloons TD. I don't know that. <laughs> have a weird place for a merry-go-round here. Nah, I look silly. I want to compact things, but I also want it to look, like, semi-normal. You know? We have, like, observation tower at the top. That could be pretty cool, actually, you know? If I have it one tile out, then I'd be able to, like, loop a path around. So, that would give me the leeway to do that. This would be a cooler-looking thing, Rebob, a cool-looking spot. But, you know, if I do this, then I get a little bit of leeway to, like, loop the path around. I mean, unless... Unless I want to loop it around back or something. Or, I could just do something, like, right next to the cinema. That's what I could do. Nah. This looks the best, but this would be probably the best function, you know. But yeah. Hey, dead ends by nature, so you always avoid them. Always avoid those dead ends. Hmm. This is right alongside the cinema. If only it was in front. Yeah, I could have, uh, looped my path around in a weird way. Would've been cool. I don't want my cue path to be too long. I don't want it to, like, loop around back or anything either. Huh. Okay. I... I mean, I could move it back or something. That would give me some leeway. That's what it would do. I could always put it back there. Sure, I'm doing it. Alright, we're building an ultra thing where people pay the big bucks for, like, the, uh, super tall observation towers. I mean, it's gonna take, like, forever for it to get up to that height, but, you know, we're building a super tall observation tower here. I actually don't know where I want the exit right now, so I'm not gonna build it right now. We charge, like, at least two bucks for the, uh, thing where Bob. But yeah, I tend to loop every path, yeah, that, and, like, have it loop through, like, the thing where Bob's that guests can spend money on in this. Alright, let's see here. Um... Snow ice entrance, and then we can go for like a snowy kind of theme and stuff. Yeah, we can go for that kind of feel. Cool. Yeah, that's 150 by default there. Yeah, so I mean, we can do something like this for a. Uh, maybe switch them around. Yeah, something like that. Something like that we can do, and then we can do like a snow ice entrance, and then we'll do like a similar thing above over here. Why not? Yeah, how long is the elevator ride to the top floor again? I don't know, a decent while. A decent while, I know for sure. Definitely takes some time. Um, nope. I wanted to see here and do like... Yeah, something like that. Or maybe I should switch them around. I don't know. So, what I was thinking for like a path through here would be something like this. I can go ahead and do this here. Like, this gives me the leeway to... Oh, no, it doesn't quite. Unless I have this go through. I guess that's an option. I guess that does technically work. It's just gonna be a little bit weird like that, but it's fine. It works. It's fine. It works. So, I guess this basically kind of forces my hand into uh, making a path set up something like that. But then the question is, how am I gonna form, like, other things around here? Like, I could probably fit, like, another three-tile kind of thing or bob in here. Is what I could, what I could do. But then how am I going to form this? Is the question of the day. Maybe like this. And then... I can say, do something like this. Alright, so that's down to 13. So I just need to go down twice. And then loop around. Let me see here. How exactly? But yeah, to park on some ice? I guess so. Hopefully it doesn't melt. Hopefully not. So, how am I gonna form this here? I mean, I could just do like that. That's what I could do. Could do something like that-ish. I don't know. I could put something else over there. So, let's see. So, now if this comes down this way. That should be able to connect here now. There we go. Something like that. And then, hello, hello, Carvia. How are you doing? 
And now I'm gonna be able to, no, I don't need to go up there. Oh, maybe I can put down the Enterprise somewhere. Maybe I can do that. All right, I might have to start putting down like some no entry signs for some of these thing bobs. Because yeah, I don't want my guests to get like too kerfuffled, you know. So that can't open up yet. This can open up. This can open up right now. Is what we can do. Oh yeah, I was gonna put on some chill tunes. Have any interest in a ride price calculator? What for Roller Coaster Tycoon? It's just now occurring to me that I literally had my chill stream playlist load up for us to like chill it to some tunes. While we're doing things here. But yeah, good. How are you still, Fragacy? Yeah, I've not gone home since this event has started. I've been crashing my car like the past several nights. Tomorrow will kind of be like a relief from the perspective of finally going home. But, you know. But, you know. Oh, no, I'll actually take one away here and then I can go like this way. And I can make it symmetrical like this then. So I'll make like a no entry thing or Bob somewhere around here so that the guests don't get like too mixed up and stuff. So that means that the observation tower is now fair game to open up. And I might recolor its thing or Bob as well. There, now we're themed. Now we're all themed for the ice and stuff. Calculates for open RCT or two, RCT 1, 2, and RCTC, huh? Which is like optimal prices. Maybe, mayhap. Maybe, maybe. Sure. We can do something like that. And then we're gonna need to go ahead and do this. Sure, there we go. There we go. Yeah, a link to it. All right, I might check it out in a bit here. Mayhap, mayhap. Did I hire a janitor? Yeah, I did. I did. I might want to set, like, his route over here. Make sure that he sticks in the area. For now, I'll just take the lazy way out and just hire a second one. So I'm gonna do for now. So how much space would the uh, Enterprise take up? And then how am I gonna fit, like... Okay, so I wouldn't be able to fit up here. Can I structure here, raise or lower land first? Good evening, Jeez, that jump scared me. Loser. How's everyone going? <laughs> My goodness gracious. Oh, let's hear it. Let's get a Marco! Oh, Hello. Baby. I don't think I'm getting an Marco. Enterprise here. Oh. Awesome, guys. I can just so make it like a little food court area. Gonna happen really, really soon. Like over here. Potluck. Mm -hmm. Food Foods. is getting prepped yeah. here, so we're going to be eating I'm working on that, guess. 10 or 15 minutes, I believe. Uh, Gil, yeah, 10, 15 for food. Five, five minutes for food. So if you have some really hungry bellies out there uh, and you, you can break a little from your games, uh, definitely come on down and get some food. Hmm. Yeah, and just so you guys know, uh, if you've contributed to the potluck, obviously you can hmm. eat the potluck. Um, definitely uh, come down and, and uh, you know get some eats. Uh, if you're out there, you haven't contributed to the potluck, but you're drooling over the potluck, go see Gil. He, he might be, you know, really nice and let you have a bite. <laughs> I might just make uh, But yeah, no, we're gonna be eating soon. And then the other thing is, Four. you're gonna have the DJ do a set uh, really soon as well. So if you want to hear him, um, he will be live in Discord. So hmm. yeah, join in, listen to some tunes. And uh, yeah, let's keep gaming all night long. Thanks everyone. Let's see. Let's see Woo. here. Woo. I can just have this like loop this way to what I could make like the no entrance thing for Bob. You know, like no entry that way and then it just like cycles them out. And then this can be like our little food court area. Is what it can be. Is what I'm thinking here. Yeah, queue for this does not need to be all that long. So I can, we can probably get away with just something like this. But yeah. Yeah, for, yeah, I take all my streams anime. This is the thing. So, I mean... I guess I kind of got to do that there. So, let's see here. So, how am I going to handle this? Hmm. I feel like it would be better, like, up around here, but, you know, I just don't really have a good way to do it. Maybe I shouldn't do, like, a food court thing there after all. Maybe I should just, like, put it down here. Because if I just, like, dig into this, 
like that. I can have, you know, my facilities. And then it's at, you know, maybe a better position anyway. You know, and it's tucked away. Hello, hello, Dracaron. So you want Blade 3 being out? Think you'll change your webcam board to include a sword from that game? No, because I freaking would have to redo, like, the whole custom animation and stuff that I do as well. Or, like, the glow. And I don't know if there's any uh, swords from that that, like, glow in a particular way. I guess Noah's sword glows kind of blue. But the current blue one on the overlay is the master sword down here. So, like, would I have to replace that? Because that's my current blue one. Okay, let's see here. Yeah, so we can do this, and then that's like, you know, this sorted out for now. Like that. Yeah, we're gonna have to keep on taking out more loan here. So I'm gonna have to do... Yeah, let's get our facilities, like, sorted out. With oh, yeah, we can have that going into the tunnel, and it's a little bit different as well. Sure. I was originally gonna turn it. What happened to my music? Oh, it's just a really quiet theme, I guess. Looks like people are starting to get things, is what it looks like. I did open it, right? Yeah. I did open it. So, do I have much reason to uh, make a thing over here at this point? Maybe. Let's see here. Can I just hit Z to rotate? No. Not like Planet Coaster there. Hmm. Yeah. I need to do that then. For this weirdness. Weird. Yeah, I can do something like that then, I guess. Yeah, indeed. Pa Look, oh, did you get a gifted sub to the channel so you have a you have that emote there, Carvia? Hmm. Let's see here. I'll do that and then like. Bam. Sure. Something like that. And then we have a couple of easy going rides. This one is labeled as Thrill, but it's more like a casual ride. That's what it's more like. Alright, let's see here. More like a gentle ride. Yeah, nice. Nice, nice. So let's see here. That's boobity bop. Let me just finish with these pads and stuff. That's what I will do. Can't really put a thing there. So I'll just do that. I'll put, like, some benches here and stuff, but, like, I just might make this, you know, an area that people aren't allowed to access back. This is what I might do. Put up the no-entry thing, Rabob. So, let's see here. So, let's see. If I, um... Can I not? Like, oh. No. Is it really not going to show me, like, the, uh, where exactly it's going to be? There we go. So if I do no entry, like that, then once they exit from these rides, once they leave, like, they're not going to be going back that way. In fact, I can even make it more efficient by putting a thing there, too, so that, you know, they don't go the other ways. I could potentially do that. So, like, they have some benches if they want to be mad chilling for a hot second, but yeah, that'll, like... You know, keep them cycled the way that we want, you know. And, I mean, if we... Thinking about dead ends, if we do want to be, like, super efficient, you know. We can literally do this for each of the... Each of the thingamabobs like that, you know. That's what we could do. Then I'll just make this park a decent bit better. Won't be the case. Yeah, something like that. Something like that. And we've got some through the sea of time that we're jamming out to. Neat. Okay, yeah, something like that. So all the things are open over here. So yeah, we did a pretty decent job of, like, compacting things over here and getting creative with the space. But yeah, I got a computer we got home in July. It's running Windows 8, though, very new. Well, still, congrats on the new computer, though, and stuff. But yeah, made it to the frag stream probably a few minutes ago, but you just noticed? Wait, to who? To Fire Red there? Do you mean? Whoops, I almost closed out the chat window, just out of habit of, like, closing the windows in this. What was the thing? Okay. So, in a hot second, we can probably start building on, like, island number two here. No, me, turn around. Oh. Oh, right there, look at that! You are right! You are indeed correct. The, uh, second one from the, uh, top. Over there. Hi! Food. Food, yeah, I'll get food in a hot second. <laughs> yeah. Hurry before the it's Bob. There, yeah, I will. I'll do it. Do you like my little thing that I made here? How much I compacted these rides and stuff? Jeez. Oh, yeah, I'm a freaking master compactor in these things. 
Yeah, I can uh, I can go get some food. Oh, I guess I made as well. a good decision here. Chili and sous vide potatoes. <laughs> well, it looks pretty good. I made a good decision. I'll go grab something. I'll go grab like a new water thing. Bob is what I'll also do to drink there. I'll be back. I would suggest the chili. I haven't tried it, but I would just suggest it. You haven't tried it, but you would suggest it. Oh, it's good. Hey, hey, quick question if this mic is on. Carva, you in the chat? <laughs> you in the chat, Carvier? Hi, uh, hi. So, this might be like kind of a mukbang because this is a giant pot potluck. Hi. No, I, I, I'm, I'm little cousin. There's something on the screen. I'm little cousin. Buy a red? Yeah! I need to go and get water. Yeah, there's big potluck though. Um, I don't know if I could. Over there, big potluck. Alrighty. Well, hello, Gino. <laughs> uh, I'll buy like a, a shulker of sand, possibly. Oh no, I can grind it pretty easy on my own with my netherite shovel. I only have to make one trip and I can get a ton. True. I think I have three totems on me now, though, Mythic. I carry three at all time. I'm probably good. And I full netherite. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no, I just try and fly through it, too. take a really long time though. The chili is spicy. that one of the things that's out there is ice cream sandwiches and I feel like those are gonna melt really <laughs> fast and I wonder if they should be in the freezer instead. Oh yeah, I told Carby it's just like a mukbang. <laughs> yeah, freaking Carby is finally getting the mukbang stream of his dreams and stuff. He's always asking me for one of those and I keep on telling him like I don't typically eat on stream but you know, then there's situations like this. Carby, you wanna see what I have? Wanna well, see freaking stuff? Whoa! I've already eaten there. most of my food. Yeah, it took me a little while to get some things there. Munch, munch. Yeah, I've eaten most of it. Mm -hmm. 
Chili's really good, but spicy. Well, I believe it. I wonder if I should have gotten a spoon instead of a fork for it here. You want me to go grab you one? Nah. <laughs> yeah. Nah. Which taters did you take? I took the freaking taters in the bag thing for Bob there. Yeah, which bag? They're all different. I don't know. One of them, they all look the same. The middle one's rosemary, the top one's garmic, and then the bottom one's regular. Garmic? <laughs> no, let's see here. Let's just see. Oh, so I like that draw <laughs> well, thing, <or> Bob. <laughs> looks like he wants to fly out now. He wants <laughs> to go for the food. Yeah. Maybe that's what's gonna convince that nerd to get over here. Oh, I guess that's the edges of the park. Yeah, one of the best ones, best things they did that hmm. that was before it was pulled pork. They sous vide pork for literally three days. Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> I can put an enterprise here. What, Jake? Mm hmm. <laughs> <laughs> One of the best things they did is was pulled pork. They sous vide uh, crapped out pork for three days. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like a lot of hard work there. <laughs> and it just fell apart. Oh. So Pro probably still pretty tasty, though. Yeah. Yeah. Did my friend ever show up? No. Mm -mm. He has not. He said that they had a bunch of meetings yesterday, and then today he said that, uh, you know, apparently stuff came up and it's been a hectic weekend, so I don't think we're doing the Spongebob movie game there. Doesn't seem like. And then freaking the first day of Thursday, he went to the, you know, the wrong place. <laughs> I mean, so. I've never beat it either. <laughs> we can do other video games at some point. Yeah. The Spongebob movie thing is going to be my thing with him there. Yeah, I miscalculated here. I thought that I could, uh... Actually, wait, maybe I still can if I just, like pull the ground down. I mean, if I just like, hmm, if I just do this here. I'm gonna have a friend over on Tuesday, but I had to work because the manager called in. I'm drinking more. Unfortunate, when stuff like that just comes up. I'm drinking more than I'm eating. There's <laughs> half a liter of water done. <laughs> oh, I need more. I mean, it's good to be drinking some fluids. There. Now, there we go. Must have done one sitting now I can't connect it. <laughs> There we go. I can go ahead and say, now it's storming and stuff. Are you gonna sleep here again? Eh, I've come this far, so maybe I may as well. There we go. What, did I not do the thing? Come on. Oh yeah. Let's see here. Because we can't hear it in real life, it just looks like the man's dancing over there when he's DJing. <laughs> Let's see here. So if I go ahead and say snow entrance, we can go ahead and change the colors. Yeah, does RCT take place in New Year? After all, it never turns to nighttime. I mean, maybe it does. <laughs> maybe. Bam, look at that. Look how cool that is. But yeah. But yeah. Wasn't letting you build it because you're about broke? No, because I freaking needed to change the elevation level instead. All right, no, wait. No way it really wants to ride this right now while it's raining, but once it stops raining, they'll probably want to ride it. Probably. And stuff. What kind of music we got playing here right now? Oh, heck yeah, the Riverlands remix. From Shetty. I've chatted with that Shetty nerd before. Seems like a cool guy. Who? Shetty. Shetty. YouTube remixer. <laughs> I'll write up basically the end of the first year here. So, 1,250 guests by that time. So, I mean, you don't have bad thus far, but I did also start with several. So, I'm gonna have to figure some things out here. I can probably double up over here, like afford to get some things that we've had down before. Oh, we can also do water things here, is what we can do technically. So, like, if we do some water things here. My guess may well like that. Maybe, maybe. So, hold on. Maybe I should do. Yeah, some designer if you just platoon addictions are gonna go AFK for a minute to do that alrighty. Here. Let's put something out here first. Is what we can do. We unlock the Ferris wheel. Okay. 
we unlock the thing. Hmm. Move this here. But yeah. Yeah, absolutely. The freezing cold water rides. Just so they don't get trapped. Because you gotta be careful of that. So, yeah, I can do something like this. And then say... I guess just that. This doesn't need to be a particularly long queue. What day is it? It's Saturday. They've been closing ceremonies today. I believe so. Since tomorrow's just a little bit of gaming in the morning and then like takedown. Yeah. And stuff. I appreciate the, the raid there, Meek Blaze. How did your stream just go? What were you just streaming? I think it was Xenoblade Chronicles 3, <laughs> if I recall. When I was looking right. I believe. If I recall. I like the raid animation. Then nobody expects the Spanish Inquisition. <laughs> One day I'm gonna have to show you more Monty Python stuff. It's real solid. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we can do that there. And then we can do like the bumper boats over here and stuff. Bam! Your raid gifts. <laughs> You're rather fitting raid gifts there. All right, yeah, we can go ahead and do this, how about? But yeah, let's see here. Yeah, <laughs> they might potentially get hypothermia doing something like that there. So, yeah, let's do like bumper boats alongside here and stuff. Doing well, and yeah, I just got well into chapter four. Okay, so you're ahead of me. I swear, it's like everybody's ahead of me in the thing. Oh, dude, I need to pull it out one more. I think I do. Oh, gosh dang, I miscalculated. I miscalculated there. This needs to be one more tile out. In the case, are you ever enjoying it thus far? Also, have you played Roller Coaster Tycoon before? By chance. Yeah, we can go ahead and do this. And then we can do, say, yeah. Do something like that. And then, um, that. Alright, I don't need to make any special track for this one. Yeah, all the way into chapter 0, Nutblade, Xenoblade 3. Well, I'm ahead of somebody. Somebody who hasn't played. Alright. Okay. Still a little bit buggy there. So I can do this, and then if I want to extend the queue later, I'll have the option to do so. I will have the option later, if I so choose to, to extend it by one tile. Essentially. Yeah. We can do that. Now there's the ad there, playing again. And stuff. Yeah. Sure. Get like this kind of theming going on and stuff. Cool. Yeah, seems pretty nice. We're decking things out here bit by bit. But yeah. Yes, you are. You're like 10 levels above the bosses in the area. Okay. Playing a whole lot of it then in that case. And yes, you have played in the past. Okay. Nice, nice. Yeah, I thought it'd be a nice chill thing while, you know, here and stuff. That's what I thought. We're munching right now because there's a potluck going on. As you can uh, kind of see over there. Yeah. Yeah, baby. <laughs> Okay, um, that's what it's all about. Yeah! Anyway, um, that's probably all the water things I'm putting here. Unless I put, like, a little thing here. Um, but yeah. <laughs> yeah, I can mention it there if you want. Mythic. Um, I mean, I could do something weird, technically. Have a thing go through here. I just worry that, like, Dudos from this ride and a potential ride that I put there might like fight, you know. Uh -oh. Or I could just put a thing like I don't know here or something. Cause yeah, that can go alongside there. I'm sure dudos from these two rides won't fight, probably. Let me check my Discord. What are you sending to me? Did you literally just send me the yeah thing, where Bob? I'm, I'm freaking streaming right now. <laughs> I'm busy building a park at the moment, but later <laughs> I can. But yeah. But yeah, but you have to get ready for work. Just see you again after your shift. Alrighty. Take care. There. Make a blaze. Have an awesome rest of the night. I'm gonna have to do something weird with this path, but whatever. This one I can. Oh, no, I can't even put it straight up. Dang it. I'll do something weird here then, I guess. I guess, yeah. Uh. Okay. 
So, what time is it right now? It's currently 7. So, a in a couple hours, there'll be the closing ceremonies, apparently. Hmm. Nobody expects this Spanish Inquisition. I appreciate the raid there, but how did your stream, stream just go? How did that go there? How are things? Let's go ahead and, uh, yeah, I'm going to need to adjust the terrain here. What were you just streaming? Just streaming? And how go things today? Welcome to Fragapalooza. Stream was heat. Well, hopefully you had some uh, AC on and stuff to cool you down in that a case. That's totally what you meant by that. Risk of rain and multiverses. Nice. Wait. For path in the way. Oh. I might actually need to not have this here then. Hmm. Yeah, that actually puts me into a bit of a tricky position in that case. I mean, can I like... I guess I can do that, right? Nope, I cannot. I cannot. I'll just fix what I did then. Huh. Yeah, I actually can't have this here. Wow. I thought that was a cool place. I thought that was a potentially neat location, but alas. It was not meant to be. The stars were not aligned on this day. I mean, I could do my weird idea again, but I mean... But yeah, <laughs> I believe it there. I believe it when it comes to Sploon. I could always put one, like, here, I guess. Maybe one there. Potentially. Look at this, something nice and chill, some swans. We got dodgems, sweet. Dodgems are pretty cool. I didn't screw myself with this location as well, did I? Probably not. I'm probably okay. I'm probably a-okay. <laughs> we'll see here. All I use is spoon. I mean, a spoon is a really handy tool. I only use not? Spoon. Let's I see here. I picked up the knife or fork. The, uh, it's only spoon. Well, I'm glad you're hyped for a mythic. Can I get away with like? No. In which case, I gotta do something like this, and do that. And then we can do that. Sure. And then when it comes to this one here, I would have to say. Oh, they're at. Oh no, that's the right level there. It says plus two here. Oh, I guess there must be stairs down there like that. <coughs> okay. Sure. And then we can just like, you know, do some uh, some stuff like that. Um, maybe I'll do, I don't know, that. I'm waiting for Crash to get back. <laughs> he still has a thing he owes me. What does he owe you? Game Smash. <laughs> Let me build a cross path. So just like this. There we go. That'll just make this a little bit more efficient then. I'll put some benches down and some things anyway. Is what I will do. But yeah. But yeah. Let's just see here. But yeah. It's affected to your usual combination. Minecraft is two and two. Um, and the first Switch game you're buying since like 2020. What? There's a whole lot of good Switch games out there though. Along the way. Alright, I should probably be eating some more. That's what I should probably be doing. Oh, we got to do cold. And then maybe do some damage to some of the ice cream sandwiches out there before they all melt. Because they're literally just out on the counter. And they're all gonna, like, get completely melted. Is a thing. So, I mean, there's that. There's that. I should put down some more rides over here. And I should make, like, a food area over here, too. I currently don't have, like, a one. So. I mean. I could do a thing literally right there. Unless I want to pass up, like, through here. Which I might. I'm gonna do it. This is my plan. This is my master plan, I think. Oh. Oh, never mind. I. Mm, weird. Well, I can do something like this. Where it, like, goes up those ways or something like that. Is what I can technically do. That could be cool, right? If we do something like this, and then we establish a place that they can, you know, satisfy their needs over here and stuff. By doing this. Let's see here. Let's just see. Make another burger joint. Like that. And then we go ahead and say, do that. Do that. So we're back up to the original loan amount now. That's the thing. But yeah. 
you stop my ones? Oh, that Splatoon 3 comes out for a Nintendo Online there. Do you ever complete that Splatoon 2 DLC? Yes. Remember a streamer radio and said it was a real treat? I did complete it. It was alright. <laughs> was the thing there? And never heard from them again. You know, it's always super awkward when a streamer that you've never seen before raids you and you try your best to like leave a good impression and they don't drop a follow and it's like, whoa. <laughs> Guess I suck as a streamer then, you know? Like they weren't impressed. So that, <laughs> that's always super, that's always super awkward. Not like I have any expectations of like anyone coming back after a raid there for sure. But you know, if someone that I've never seen before raids me, I judge, you know, you know, <laughs> their impression of me by whether they drop a follow or not. Like, is this streamer that I've never met before worthy of a, worthy of following? Guess I'll go ahead and do that. But if they don't, it's like, well, guess, guess this is like a bad choice for a raid. And it's like, well, that sucks. That sucks. So, you know, I guess I, uh, I tried my best to leave a good impression, but apparently I did not. <laughs> so, sucks to suck. Can I, like, can I do something weird here? I might move that down, like, one here. Can I just strip do a thing here? That'd be pretty cool. That seems pretty cool, right? And then can this go under? No. That would have been too cool. The coolness level would have been, like, overboard. But we can just, like, have it come around. And, like, connect up some way. Some way, somehow. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. Why am I always struggling to find the uh, snow ice entrance? I don't know, something like that? Maybe? But yeah, I always find that super awkward. So let's see here. What might I want to build like in the middle here? I mean, we haven't built a ferris wheel yet. But that's one of those weird shapes that I might figure out how to fit in like a different way, you know? There's flying saucers. Mm. That's a good place for it. That's a good spot for it. I think here. That's a good spot for that. Me thinks. Yeah, I thought Octo Expansion was like the best single player Nintendo game since like, I don't know, where the, I, was, I thought it was okay, but like, eh. It wasn't anything super phenomenal, in my opinion, but that is me. But yeah. If it wasn't works with people who are big into Splatoon, maybe that was the reason then. But yeah. When, <laughs> if I get raided by someone that I don't know, and they just like skedaddle without following it. I always just assume like, oh, guess they didn't like me. <laughs> you know, is the case. So, hmm. And then I could always like, I don't know, do that. Just so that this is a little bit easier going. Uh, here. Let's see here mini helicopters. I'm not gonna build that. Not happening. Here, and then this will also eliminate like this dead end. This is what it'll do. If we're able to open this up. So how is this path gonna come through? Like this weird setup that I started making. So it doesn't need to come up that way. But like, it'll come through here at least. But yeah. <laughs> it's okay, Aronia. If I raid you, I'd follow you. No, you wouldn't. You raid me all the time and you never do car- No, I'm just joking. Um, <laughs> ah, Moncha Moncha, Moncha Moncha, it's so weird without having the projectors back there. Also, I should probably put like the Mario Kart stuff away here at some point. Oh, they looks like they're trying to fix these here. I'll pack away the Mario Kart stuff so it's out of their way, is what I'll do. Let's see here. We have we Find the 
that I made here, specifically for the Mario Kart thing, Bob. It's crazy. saddening to put my ramps away in the trash. <laughs> Big sad. Alright. Let's see here. Alright, year two just started. Wow, I'm gonna keep munching here. So I should do before everything goes cold. So how am I gonna do this? Hmm. I can do like a weird zigzaggy thing, sort of. No, I couldn't, because that, no. This actually has to keep going up and, like, around, because the chairlift is in the way. This is the thing. You know. So I might actually have to do, like, this. So I may actually have to do... Something like that, and then I can, like, fit some things into here. So what I can do... Ah! Mmm. Um, I could have always done go-karts around here. I mean, they, uh, go-karts do make big money in Roller Coaster Tycoon, after all, you know. I still could, but, like, hmm. Good evening, folks. I hope that pop luck is sitting pretty in your bellies and all of your... Full and happy this playing right your games. That's right, hi, cool. Uh, we got a resident DJ, SSJ Lynch, and he's up on Twitch. So everybody give him a shout, give him a, give him a round of applause. He's a great DJ. And uh, he's also live in Discord. If you don't want to be bothered uh, by the music, you can go into Discord if you're not on Twitch and you can give him a listen. Thanks everyone. Keep on gaming. I can probably go down here, right? That was, um, I apologize for that, um, that was certainly something, yeah. What, sorry? That was me pushing the wrong what? button. What? Okay. Don't do it. <laughs> Let's see here. It's like 90 buttons to push. I pushed the 91st one. <laughs> Where? What? Is it in the freaking ground? I mean, it hasn't returned yet. I'm genuinely so confused. <sighs> well. So Alvin Drake just came see and told us that potluck is now open for everyone, regardless if you brought food or not. So go eat, guys. <laughs> Let's see here. So yeah, they're gonna be munching some things there. I might see about them ice cream sandwiches over there, because they're gonna freaking melt. They've been left out for a little while. There's a thing. So like... What? Oh. Well, that sucks. Hmm. What? Oh. Oh, that sucks. Well, that sucks. Um, yeah, I guess it really is, isn't it? In a way. Wow. 
Okay, well, this freaking sucks, I guess. Now I'll roll. Hmm. Hmm. But yeah. Hello, hello, CJ. We're doing it because it's a good game. This is why we're doing it. <laughs> I'm surprised you're asking about the game and not, like, the venue. <laughs> so I'm surprised about. <laughs> let's see here. Should I, like, let's see here. <laughs> let's just see. Oh, yeah, it's a good video game. Well, I guess I can go down, like, one more in that a case. So I can do something like this and then, like, do some zigzag and shenanigans. Like this or something or other. Oh my goodness, look at this. Wow. Maybe I really should set like some routes for my uh, dudos. Alright. Here we go, Frags. I figured you were just doing it. Yeah, well, yeah. I guess there's that. I forget if you've already been into one of these frag streams or not. It's all blurring together. I have not left the venue in these past several days. I've literally just been sleeping in my car. It's all blurring together, if I'm gonna be honest. So, you know. So there's that. <laughs> It's all a blur at this point. I'm hiring another one, but like, I might just set like a route for them. Might be the better option, you know. So let's see here. Do some zigzagging. So we're out of the way there. And we start to like work our way back up again or something or other. Yeah, everything's been going pretty alrighty here. And things are going pretty chill. There wasn't a massive ton of turnout in both Smash and the Mario Kart thing that I was hosting. We're hoping that hopefully next year, you know, there'll be more people open to, you know, get into things. Wait, why can't I do it? Is it because of too high for- it's literally just too high for sports. Hmm. 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 I mean... I could find some other way to do this, right? Right. 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 That's the right height now. Uh, so that needs to start going up like one sooner. Huh. Yeah, if you could try and find attendance or capacity, it seems like a fun thing to try and socialize. Yeah, for sure. It definitely can be. It's an interesting thing, Rob. It feels very much like for this event, everyone's kind of very absorbed in their own world and whatnot and not participating in, like, a whole lot of events and stuff. It seems like, like, I was, uh, I was literally just talking earlier with the person that was hosting the, uh, the Gran Turismo tournament that they were doing. Apparently, they got two people to register. We got eight for the Smash tournament, if you count, like, you know, if you don't count me and my co-commentator also playing just so you, like, you know, there would be more attendees and stuff. And like we weren't, uh, we decided that we wouldn't be eligible for prizing. We would just like play purely for funsies, <laughs> essentially. But yeah, so without us, it would literally be an eight-person smash tournament. Two people for the uh, Gran Turismo racing, with the grand prize being like a paid trip to go to an actual racetrack and have like a day of like you know lessons and race stuff and whatnot, essentially, and be able to like drive on said track. And literally, only two people registered. I would have if I had the game, but. Yeah, or like the Mario Kart thing that I set up, the RC Kart Mario Kart. Got like maybe two or three people that actually came up here that wanted to try it out. Like, so, you know, for this hybrid event, it could also be because, you know, after COVID times and whatnot, there's still, you know, a lot of weirdness of like, how the heck do we handle things? But, wow. But, you know, that's the, uh, that's the state of things, essentially. Um, huh. Hmm. Like this? Like that? And then I can make like an entrance and exit? Yeah. And then we can like... Yeah. We can do something like this. Cool, that works. And then we have a freaking go-kart thing for Bubs. So that should make bank. But yeah. Yeah, honestly. Like the freaking... The Smash tournament, for example, that only eight people registered for? It was a $200 prize pool tournament. Like, first place is getting 120 bucks. Second place, Carvia, 60 bucks, you know? Like, it's not half bad there for such a low turnout thing. And then the thing Bob with, like, the racing thing Bob is like, wow. Like, I would register if I had that, uh, if I had that game, but I don't. If I did, I would totally play in it. But, you know, freaking, I don't know why people are passing up this kind of thing. 
like we're hoping that next year once it's back to like fully in person again it'll be a it'll be a lot better all right i'm just gonna hire like a second mechanic it's probably about that time let's see here so number of laps we can set two um 12 cars will be the max here for that station i'll probably charge like a but yeah, if you're a Gran Turismo 7, you do that? Yeah, heck yeah. And when I was talking to him, he was telling me, like, it can be, like, international people that, you know, that can do that. But, you know, if you win, like, the trip to the freaking racetrack thing, Bob, it's valid, like, forever. Just freaking stop by there and say that you won the thing, Bob, and they'll be like, okay, here, you can you can do the thing, Bob, then, essentially. Like, if ever you stop by locally. But literally only two people registering, so it's like, wow. Wow. What a world we live in, huh? Um, I wonder. Let's see here. I should still be, I need to not forget to eat. What do I need to do? Let's see. Let's see here. Do I actually have to go straight down? Wow, and that's not even good enough there. Just wow. Well. No. I can do something like that, right? And I'll have to figure out something like here. So yeah, I'm honestly really surprised at like the turnout for some of these things, you know. I'm quite genuinely surprised. Huh. Darn it. Darn it. But yeah, whenever you take your own car, I'd love to rip your bird around a racetrack, not gonna lie. Yeah. Well have been really neato, but Apparently, very few people interested in uh, registering for that. It seems like. I wonder here. I think something like that. There we go. And it like loops around and stuff. And then we can um. Uh. Let's see here. Something like that. And then um. I can do something like this. Sure. Not exactly how I envisioned this coming together, but, you know, works, I guess. Now. Yeah. Well. Sure. Sure. So we can do that. Let's go ahead and say, uh. Oi. The this. The that. There we go. Look, that's cool now. Now it's all nice and cool. And we didn't even do any duplicates with Elder Island yet. That's the thing. Do you even even have to do that? Like, this is gonna fit in here, but I can't put the entrance and exit down. There's not really much point. I mean... Hold on. Hold on. No, there still wouldn't be much point here. Right? I mean, I could do it, I think. I have to be like... I just have to do a weird thing twice. But I can do it. Right? Assuming that track isn't in the way. Right? Yeah, look. I can fit it here. I just need to do, like, this ultra weird thing. Twice. So, like... But it does work. Here, I'll actually raise it up instead of lowering it down. Whoops. I am doing this. That's what I want to do. There. There. And then we can, like... Yeah, number of rotations, one. Is my own music gone? Like, we have some of the... Oh, it's just a really quiet theme is all it is. Because there is, like, some music now in the venue and whatnot. But yeah, I sure... Oh, yeah. That's a... I might honestly... That is actually a genuine concern there. As if they're playing copyright music. Oh. Yeah. Well, here's hoping. Okay, so that's um probably the best that I can do here, unless there's like something tiny that I can uh, cram in over here. But you know, I'd be hard pressed to find something that I can do there. I mean, the top spin is really tiny, to be fair. Hmm. I don't see any reality in which this works, unless I have like no Q line at all. I mean, I could do like this technically. That's what I could do, right? I mean, hmm. Hmm. 
But how would I attach the uh, thing or bob? Oh, I see how I can do it. I see it now. Wait, no, I don't. I have to pull the uh, the thing one back. I can do that. I can do that. I'm uh, I'm just gonna do this for a hot second. Don't mind me. If I make like the space available here, I can do something like this. Oops. And then I can do that, and then open this up again. And now we have room for the top spin to do the uh, the thing Bob that I'm thinking here. Unless I like, um, <laughs> well, glad that it sounds like you're having a good time with that there. No. Select like the whole tile, please. My goodness, I'm not gonna be able to, am I? I can do that, I guess. Well, there, I guess. Well, that was expensive, but what you gonna do? What you gonna do? Um, can I place it down, please? There we go. Yeah, look, this is a thing that I can do now. I just need to, like... Sorry, fellas. Sorry, fellas. But I kinda gotta do this. And then I can literally fit this in like this. Like this. Bam. There we go. There we go. And if we go ahead and say, um, do that, and bada bing bada boom, we have another ride there. Sweet. But yeah. What would it take to get you to drown guest four six two of these store in the park? I don't think I'm gonna do that because my rating's gonna drop like crazy. I don't want that to happen. You know, probably not a good idea. Let's see here. Let's just see. It'll still hurt a bit, I'm sure. Most likely. It'll still hurt me a smidge. A decent smidge that I don't want to hurt me. You know? And I did make the food and drink thing over there, so yeah, that's good. I did already do that. Here, I'll just do this. Eh, sure. Sure. Okay, I can't even see, like, what I'm hitting there, but... You know, it's something there. Okay, I'll just make this a little bit better by doing this. So yeah, I guess I'll do the strat where we eliminate the dead ends and stuff. Sure. Roto jump. Bam. Okay. Cool. Uh, I'm not gonna eliminate this one because this will be like the new bench area. Like that. Cool. Cool. Well, I guess five nine five. I don't know about guessing five nine five. Him and me are pretty tight. We go all the way back since high school. Him and I. Look at this. Look at these two islands here now. Also, you should probably do that. I haven't saved this whole time. You know. So, do I just want to make like a bridge over here or something? I mean, we can chill for a hot second. That's what we can do. And I can eat. Oh, look at these islands and stuff. Look how cool that is. Go neat. Bam. Give you 100 bits for your ground. If <laughs> 595 is in the park. Like I said, him and I go way back. I don't know. I don't know about that. My oh my. Well. At first I thought that was someone coming up to me. I was like... Someone coming up to say hi to me? Guess not. Guess not. I was incorrect. But yeah. Hmm. People really enjoying this? Heck yeah, let's increase the price, sir. I don't know. Sure. I only have the one information kiosk. I wonder if I should have like some more around. Like this is a pretty good location for one here, for example. 
Especially with like, you know, it raining like this. You know. Can I place it down, please? There we go. And we'll do like, I don't know. We can have Poiple for this one. And then if we have like one over here, a good location. Well, the location for it around here would be like, I don't really see a corner anywhere. A flat corner that I can use. I guess there's this. But like... <laughs> oh, yeah. I guess that works. Yeah, sure. Sure! And then, um... I don't know, green on that one. Sure. Now, right, information chaos are probably pretty good to have some of around, you know? Probably pretty good. Oh, well, the cinema broke down. That sucks. Unfortunate, you know? Yeah, not one to delve into the closet. Is the tradition of drowning random people? Are no, I don't do that. I don't do that kind of thing. Hmm. There's a lot of track-based things. I don't think work here if you use any of the pre-made designs. Bam! Yeah. Are there any, like, really tiny coasters we can make or something? I wonder. Um. Maybe it's something that I'll look into before I ever attempt it, you know? Maybe that's something that I'll look into, at least. Bam. Yeah, that's what I figured. Um. I wonder. We don't really have anything that's small, per se, do we? I don't think. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna be able to construct like anything that's pre-made during this park. Oh, does it remove guess where the park functions the same as them? Just what? Well, yeah, again, I'll do like proper research into it before uh, before doing anything like that. I think that's what I'ma probably do. Oh, I just that ain't good. I'm using a plastic fork and I just bit a bit of plastic off the fork by accident, which means it's now somewhere in this bite. Well, I might get a little bit of plastic into my system. Um, well, if I find it while I'm chewing, then I do, but otherwise, at least it wasn't like my tooth had chipped or something like that. The Mobius coaster? Like it's a Mobius coaster. I don't know what that is. Yeah, it's Morbin time. Okay, um, so, this is literally just like a standard thing, just with like a fancy layout. I'm blocking them! But it could do, but yeah. I think a dueling coaster, but each track ends at the other station. Sounds like way above my pay grade here. That kind of sounds like, let me make it more beast themed. Let's see here, how expensive would this get? If I like... <coughs> 260? Okay. Alright, 500. I'd... Sure, we can do like a design, even though it's literally just like the scenery and whatnot. Mobius Coaster Loop is a racing coaster with a trick of two different sides and the coaster layer contains both stations for one full circuit. Sounds neato, but sounds above what I'm capable of. Oh yeah. So, look, that's cool. That's cool over there. But now, I'm gonna have to figure out how to have to get over there, you know? That's what I'm gonna have to do. So, I mean, maybe it'd be better if I started like down here or something. That's what it might be. But yeah, I wanna play RCT2 and make a coaster there. Okay, just so that I'm not paying, like, too, too much for the supports and stuff. But, uh, wow, straight up there, ghost train. Okay, so now we can open up the thing. This is what we can do. And then, uh, let's see here. Because, yeah, this is gonna, it is across the path. 
I don't know what you mean, game. It is across the path, indeed. I don't know what you want from me. Sure, we'll do something like this. So you can watch if you want to get open RC2 and play. Yeah, I know. I know. I've it's been uh, it's been mentioned to me. <laughs> it has been many times. In both this stream and like what feels like every other comment on my RCT uh, video essay, interestingly enough. Oh. Launch, launch, launch. Launch, launch. But yeah, an aquarium would be really cool if I could build that. If I could do that, I'd be pretty hyped. Oh, this is a cute little corner for something like this, right? Hmm. But I need to actually, you know, get the path to like come around here, you know? Is what I would need to do. So. Hmm. Hmm. Let's see here. What I might honestly do is start this like one earlier. That's what I might do. Like this. Nope. Dang it. Well, booby bop. So there's one earlier here. And then we can have like a little checkpoint of sorts. Is what we can have. Alright, keep on moving, Mr. Dudo. And then we can have like this. Or something. And then... And then we can do this. But yeah. Um, yeah, that's, that's kind of the way open RCT2 is with me. I, I hear about it a whole lot, you know. I love it, but let's see here. Let's see here. So yeah, do that, and then I'll like. Whoa. Then we can do that. Can I fit a thing in here? I wonder. Before I get too carried away. Hmm. Have a rotor drop right next to that drop, would that be a bit too much here? Okay, these can't be too tall. Because people won't go on it if it's too intense. This is the thing. Okay, so it is valid to like put a thing over that. Interestingly enough. Tis valid there. But yeah. <laughs> yeah, it would be a pretty place to go if, you know, it's not stupidly cold. At least. Which it probably would be. Let's see here. Let's just see here. So we can do something like this. And then if we do this, it can go like this kind of way. And then boopity bop like that. And then, uh, I don't know, something like that, something like that or other, cool, and then if we go ahead and say, do that, yeah, oh yeah, start decking out this place and stuff, I might guess that I need, I was like 1250, right, yeah, 1250 by the end of year three, okay, yeah, we can do that. I can do that. So it wasn't fake icebergs who would really build an amusement park on a real iceberg. Yeah. <laughs> Could well be. Could well be majorly dangerous and stuff. Why? So, can I fit anything down here slash do I want to? You know, maybe this will be like my thrill ride area. That's what maybe this will be. Hmm. If I do something weird here, just making 100% certain that's attached. I could always do something really weird. Nope. Like this. Something like this may- oh, hold on. 
Yeah, this is right, right? No, it's not. Now it's right. There we go. And then this path can like start leading to things as well. You know, this is what it can do. Yeah. So let's see here. Booty bop. And we can like, you know, do the thing. Something like that. Something like that ish. But yeah. People don't want to build on real icebergs because money. People would totally not build on real icebergs because money. Because that's how you lose money. You know? That's how you make a bad investment. So it's because of money that that would not happen. <laughs> As a matter of fact. Let's just see here. Let's just see. Boop -bop. What? I did not mean to replace that there. Well, whatever, I guess. I guess that's that now. I'll replace it again here. And then, uh... Yeah. Let's do something like this. Okay. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'm totally gonna get freaking copyright stricken, whatever. Or copyright claimed, at least. Hopefully, uh... I know... Hmm. I don't know. I'm not too concerned about YouTube. Worst case on YouTube is usually that they just like take away like, you know, revenue on that video. But Twitch. Twitch can straight give you a strike on your channel for having copyright music in the background. So if that happens, then I'm gonna ask them at future frags to maybe uh <laughs> use copyright free music, you know. And whatnot. I don't know what happened to that. But I guess we shall see. Hopefully it's a okay. Hopefully. Let's just finish up here. Moncha moncha. Okay, yeah. It was tasty. It was indeed. Okay, um. Let's see here. What do we want to put here? We can put another Enterprise down. This is what we can do. That's a good spot for it, right? That's a pretty good spot for it. I mean, right? If maybe I like... How am I going to make this path first? Let's maybe figure that out first. So let's see here. Nope. So yeah, exit can be there. And then, um... We like. Uh, I changed my mind. Because instead, we can like do this, and then the exit can connect without too much hassle. You know, what we can do. Any cool new restaurants around to try? What? I don't think so. Um, let's see here. So yeah, maybe I'll see about like what else I might want to put in here first before I get too carried away. So, hmm. oh yeah, we have a swinging bird ship now. I can't do that. Well, I can, but I have to do something weird with the entrance. Wait, can I? Whoa, 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 wait. Can I put it here? Oh my goodness, I can. That's a potential solution. That works. That then gets the entrance out of the way. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I mean, I want a decent queue line for an enterprise, so I can do that. Okay. Yeah. Look at that. Bam. Cool. Yeah. Cave system. A Minecraft cave system out here. This is what we got. Okay. And then we'll like I don't know. Sure, and then I can put a, uh, I can put a swing inverter ship there after all now. That's what I can do. Yeah, that's a fair game now. So, let's see here. Hmm. And then this can be, like, fair game for a food area then. The same thing we did yesterday. That's what it can be. I can put like the facilities for this island here. That's what I can do. You know? And then that's covered. So let's see here. Come on. Information kiosk. 
So yeah, I can do that. Open that up. Yeah, maybe I'll just leave this one as red. Is maybe what I'll do. And then... Yeah, look, this is like the perfect space here allocated. For this kind of thing now. The perfect amount of space. We can change things up and do a coffee here. As long as it's like some kind of drink, you know. This is what we can do. And then... Yeah, give them all their uh, all their facilities that they need. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Okay. So uh. Oop. That was meant to be the trash bin. That's what that was meant to be. As we do our alternating here. Sure. Well, that works out perfectly with the stairs there, doesn't it? Yeah, do our alternating kind of pattern there. There we go. Yeah. So if I had, like, really gone hard, I probably could have done it by, like, the end of year two, then. That's what I probably could have done. Quite frankly. So I can fit in something like this here. For fun. Ooh, what about? Let me just do this here. Let me do that. And then, um... Sure, that. And then over here... Sure, that. And then snow ice entrance. I wish you could just, like, set all the entrances in the park to something or other. I kind of wish. I guess this one has to go around a little bit like that. Because, yeah. So I can do this, and there's also plenty of space there on the, uh, on the side for some other things, you know. So then if we do that, then bada bing bada boom, we can open that up. Also, it's probably gotten to the point where we should probably hire, like, a third mechanic. Most likely. Because, yeah, there's quite a few things around. It's like one mechanic per island. It could be if I actually assign them. I just don't really want to take the time to like go assign them all and stuff, you know. Don't really want to do that. So, yeah, this is going to be like our thrill ride island. The island of thrills is what this will be. This can fit here like this, technically. On a technicality. Space rings. I, I think that counts as a gentle thing. Even though I would think that'd be a thrill thing, but I think it counts as a gentle thing, if I recall. If I quite recall. Okay. Yeah. We've come to that point again. Yeah, we pro it's not like we need to worry about repaying the loan, like, you know, immediately soon by any means. Anything like that. Don't need to worry about that. The twist. Do the twist. Do the thing. Sure. Bam. Look at that. I'm gonna hire like two more handymen instead of just assigning my current ones around because I'm feeling a little bit lazy. I don't want to do that. You know. My interest rate and check how long the scenario is. The scenario is three years. The loan interest rate is 10%. But yeah. Yeah, I, I don't think that it's a, I don't think that's going to be all that worth it, especially considering we're going to hit, like, the 1250 that we need, like, very soon here anyway, is the thing. Without even needing the thing, Bob. Is there anything that can fit into there? I don't think so. I think a thrill ride that could fit into there, I don't think there is. So, I mean, we could always, like, if we do this, we could have the path underneath, I think fairly certain we can. That sounds kind of cool, you know. That sounds kind of neato, but yeah. Yeah, I mean, if it says to have, like, your loan repaid. Otherwise, otherwise it's not too big of a deal. You are correct. So that should be able to go underneath now. Should be able to. Yeah, look at that. Pretty cool. Pretty neato. And then we can do this, like that. And then do like the same thing for the queue here. 
That's how you fit that in there. I'm dumb. Let's see here. Yeah, like that. Like that, there we go. Oh, but this one is gonna have to like show something else. Be like variety, you know. For variety's sake. Okay, so I can really fit one more thing in here. We're gonna head out and try to see some Isaac to your friends. See you later. All right, take care of there, CJ. Appreciate yourself by hanging out. Have a good time streaming some Isaac to friends there. Yeah, space rings. They're a gentle thing. Apparently. Apparently, they're a gentle thing. Yeah, this is literally Thrill Ride Island. So what am I missing? Do I actually have all the thrill rides right now? I mean, what's our research looking like? Gentle ride. Yeah, there's still some other thrill rides to go. Is the thing. Like, I have that. I have that. I have that. I have... I don't have that, but that's like, you know, a track thing. And I won't be able to do it with the supports. I have that. I have that, I think. Yeah, I have that. 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 So I have the things. I literally just have to wait on, like, the next one. Pretty much. I mean, we're almost at, like, 12.50 anyway. So, like, you know, we're basically at the goal that we need. So I guess I probably am going to hit, like, the goal before the end of the second year. Is the thing. It's not going to be super important there. Yeah. I'm kind of tired. I've been sleep deprived the past few days of, you know, getting whatever sleep I can in my car. I actually sleep, like, pretty decently soundly. It's just that, you know, once the sun rays start coming in, it starts getting, like, insanely stuffy in there and stuff. Man. Man. It's insanely stuffy in there, and it gets, like, really, really hot in there. It becomes, like, unbearable. So I'm not exactly getting, like, full bits of sleep, but, you know. Tomorrow is the final day, essentially, so I've been going pretty ham with, you know, stuff here and the things that we're streaming here and whatnot. But tomorrow is the final day, and it'll just be, like, you know, some stuff in the morning and then, like, packing up. And what the hell is this? Can't believe I left that there. Yeah, look, we did the thing we bought before the uh, uh, this year. I'm gonna go throw my plate away. We're gonna see if those freaking ice cream sandwiches that seemed like they were gonna melt are still out. And if they are, I'm gonna take one and we're gonna put the others in the freezer. <laughs> this is the case. So I'm a chick. They were indeed put in the freezer. So that's good. That's good there. Yeah, look, we did the thing where Bob. And we filled up like three islands. Did my like ultra compaction stuff here. This honestly makes me want to stream like a little bit of Minecraft. <laughs> like, because my Minecraft series on the channel has just been like, you know, applying the lessons that I got from, you know, playing Roller Coaster Tycoon a whole bunch back in the day when it comes to compaction. Since, you know, you do have to get creative in the hideaway after all to like, you know, compact things there. I don't know what I do though, because like, you know, there's no point in recording a time lapse here because, you know, the cameras will be off anyway. You know what? No, if I was doing that, I do have to. Like, hmm. I was talking uh, semi recently like, during like Mario Odyssey there about how I need to build like a, you know, a thing revolved for entry two anyway. I could do that on stream, uh, but that kind of thing would probably be better like off stream, I would imagine. Yeah, since you're afraid to do a micro stream and give you a tour around our shenanigans, potentially. Potentially have like a look-see around at what's going on there. And maybe I maybe I wouldn't include it in like the uh, you know the archive of like the Twitch streams there if we did do like you know stuff like potentially building that project that I need to start working on anyway. That's I might well do. Just because you know it's spoiler kind of stuff. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe maybe haunted mansion ride. I'm not building that. We can probably just go into like super speed and you know chill the hell out. So like we could do did like the first two hours without any super speed here. I'm a wancha wancha. Yeah. Once you let you know and you'll hop out of a hurry, alright, I'll keep it in mind there. Wancha munch. Wow. They really like the iceberg bobs.
Merry Lord. October year two. Year two's about to end. The same park in the country. Sweet. It's 8 p.m. Hello? Oh, now it's back? I don't know why that happened. Weird. Strange. I don't know why the heck that was. I was just saying that, you know, it's freaking 8 p.m. And I know that my doubles partner said that, you know, Crash there said that he was gonna, you know, get here pretty late and such. But it's starting to get pretty late. Pretty, pretty late. Um, I'll hire another mechanic. That's what I'll do. It takes me out of super speed for some reason. Don't know why that is. But yeah. Yeah, I think we can just be chilling and stuff, you know? I think we can just chill here now. Yeah, I'm working on it. So yeah, there we have it. I mean, we basically win. Basically just wait and win and it'll be great. A crooked house. Me. I just kind of want to take it easy now. You know, I've been going ham on so many video games during, uh, during Fragapalooza here. So... Sometimes it's nice to just sit back and win. You know, still hasn't been fixed. What are they doing? Actually, what are they doing? My goodness, the AI's broken. Doesn't know where to go. Oh my good gracious. Is no one... Why is no one going to the observation tower? What is happening here? I'm genuinely so confused. There. That fixed the AI, apparently. Don't know why that was, but okay. But okay for some reason. Boop. Wow, the fancier one. The cooler Daniel. What do you mean? Looks pretty darn fixed to me. I don't know what the game is talking about. I don't know what the heck the game is on about right now. Ah. No, not Enterprise 2. That's my favorite Enterprise. It's my favorite one. Wow. But yeah. But yeah. Look, this has been nice and chill. This whole event has been, you know, certainly something. I think it's the first time I've actually streamed from Frag. Like, I don't think I live streamed at Frag 2019. I might have only been Smash. I might have live streamed Smash Bros. At Frag Blues 2019. I don't think you can find, like, those VODs anymore. I don't think they are around anymore. I think they've been lost to the, uh, Twitch freaking cusp of time where Twitch deletes VODs and stuff. Oh, come on. I'll hire more handymen in that case. I'll hire some more then. I'll bring it up to 14. How about? Or about 15. A nice even number, only that it's odd. You know? It's like the one nice looking odd number. In terms of like a number or something. <laughs> but I mean, it is just... I mean... I was about to say because it is half of an even number, but you could say that about every odd number, but you know what I mean. You know what I mean. Going up to ten. Man, what not? Watch, watch, watch. Man, if that Carby nerd is lurk lurking, he's gotta be over the moon in joy right now. Getting like the one mukbang stream. The one. 
Am I getting pings on Discord? Or is that just the frag thing? Or yeah. Something in announcements. Um, I want to let everyone know that giveaways for the closing ceremonies in roughly one hour will be done. In Twitch chat, you must be a follower to enter. Use the raffle plus for each drawing. Must be a follower for at least 10 minutes. So, okay. Well, you guys are going to be doing giveaways here during the closing ceremonies on the uh, official frag stream. Is a thing. Apparently, you need to have been the, a follower of the frag channel for a little while and need to be like an entity on their site. So, I think the prizes are like physical thing, Bobs. But if nerds like that Carvia nerd that might come here one day anyway, <laughs> enter in that and win something, I just either hold on to it for you or send it to you. If that's where the case, if you're feeling so inclined. But, my goodness gracious. I guess we're hiring another one. I was thinking about it. I was thinking about it. Ah. No, not Cinema 1. Why well, couldn't it have been Cinema 2? Oh. What I should actually do. Is, uh... One, the loan's gone. And two. Apparently, this is a freaking thrill ride. Somehow. Yeah, I know. They're constantly complaining. I know. I get it. Hmm. Meh. Man, I just spammed the large tram machine to open RCT2 and summon 3,000, 35,000, 976 guests. That is a whole lot. That right there would be a whole lot, verifiably. Hmm. Oh, I'm gonna have to do something weird with the path here, but whatever. But whatever, I guess. Whatever I suppose I will make do. I watch you drive around the ball. <laughs> what if I just do like this and then I can just. I can just do that. There, now we have the loop. Now I can feel better about this. Now that we have the loop. Well, loop is stall. Oh, I guess we ran out of rides that we can research here. In that case, is that that means. Yeah, I mean. Whoops. Whoopsie doopsie. Um. I mean, I don't know. Those would be like my next priority, I guess. But yeah. Um, if you use the cheat and summon that many guests on a path with nothing but a toilet, then make them all have to use the bathroom. All 35,976 guests. Well, then just walk into the same bathroom at the same time. <laughs> I mean, I just imagine it suddenly become like one of those memes where you uh, see somebody walk into the washroom and there's all the guys that are like singing the Halo song. The Halo title screen thing, where Bob is what they're all just doing in there together, except 35,000 of them, you know. That's all that's going on there, just normal guy things, you know, just normal things that dudes do. Okay, what there, jeez, finally let me finally let me do the thing. <laughs> Down a thing there. Yeah. There we go. There we go. Okay, come on. Come on, man. But yeah, just walk into the bathroom and get immediately crushed to death by 35,000 guests at one tile restroom. I mean, there are some restrooms out there that get like pretty, pretty packed. So, I mean, all right. We're gonna win here in a hot second. It's going to be great. Unless I majorly miscalculated the uh, thing, Rob. No, it's 12.50. It is 12.50. So... Yeah. So I'll just save like right before it does the thing, Rob. Just in case I ever need to do like any save data transfer shenanigans. I keep like all my parks and stuff. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty decently tired here. <laughs> Log flu, whoa! But Roller Coaster Tycoon was chill. Roller Coaster Tycoon was a chill time. I mean, Roller Coaster Tycoon's always a bit of a chill time, you know. It is always the case. So, yeah, I'll just save like here then. That's what I'll do. Yeah, let's see here. Well, people are vandalizing my freaking benches and stuff. Wow. 
I did the thing. I made everybody proud and stuff. Bam. Wow. So I guess we'll now go, uh, yeah. Do that. And now we have Iceberg Islands done. Did Iceberg Islands and Fun Fortress. Wow. Such a fun fortress. Be cool if just like all the parks were available right off the bat. Would be neat. Would be neato there. But yeah, if ever I do try something like open RCT2, I can literally just transfer over my save files. This is the thing. Probably, right? Probably? Mmm. Mmm. I would just stream like one of my playthrough things, but that would <coughs> that would just be an invitation for one of my playthrough things to get copyright claimed. So like it might not be the best of ideas to do that. Maybe not. So I'm probably gonna be streaming late tonight. Most likely, they're probably not gonna have like the music playing into the dead of the night. You know, it's. Or do I want to keep going for a little while? Cause then I can stream like the freaking closing ceremonies and stuff. You know, just hit a checkbox that unlocks all scenarios. Oh, and open RCT2. It's handy. There's more park scenarios. Oh, the uh, Six Flags thing or Bob's. Wait, why is Panda World a separate thing? Challenge parks, Panda World. Okay. Weird. And then there's like these thing robots as well. Yeah, it lists it in a kind of weird way, doesn't it? Lists it in a kind of strange way, I must say. Well, I'm not quite sure what to do from here. I'm gonna like rearrange some thing robots because like I'm now realizing that I have my beanbag chair literally right underneath the uh, table, and that's usually where I have it at like home. So I can uh, do the thing where Bob where I use my beanbag chair as a leg rest, just like I do at home and whatnot. Maybe I'm also feeling pretty tired. This is the thing. And you know, I do want like the Twitch VOD stuff <laughs> with that to also be like archived, to be like an accompanying thing to like. I always link like all the uh, all the Twitch VODs in the description of any YouTube thing or Bob. So you know, at the same time, I kind of want that to be within the canon as well, in a sense. So. Yeah, there's a, there's that. So, I don't know here. I don't know. This is where I'm gonna wrap up Roller Coaster Cycling Classic at least. We did another new park. I don't know when the last time we did the last one was, but hey, here's another park. I think this was like stream four or something like that of this. So it's not like I've streamed it a whole lot, but hey, it's certainly something. I can, uh, <laughs> nah, I need a, I need something that, you know, is gonna really appeal to me and be like super duper chill and whatnot. Because again, I'm sleep deprived. And we're in a bit of a intermisting environment right now, you know. It's kind of the case. But with that, yeah, I'm wrapping up Roller Coaster Tycoon like Classic there. So thanks all who tuned into that. And yeah, we're gonna figure out what to do from here, essentially.